I got a package I ordered a while ago from Yoseka Stationery, so I thought I would just unbox it. I ordered some inks and some samples, so I am, and I've been waiting for a little bit because the mail, of course, is taking a bit longer than it normally would, so I am super excited that it's finally here. Careful and don't cut yourself like I almost did. Nicely packaged. Oh. I have been so excited about these inks. I'm so excited about these inks. These are the Linen Toolbar They're T Series. Uh, linen Toolbar. So this one is the Sun Moon Lake Black Tea. This one, Mucha, 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 Iron Goddess. And then the Winshan Pushong tea. And I just, I love tea colored inks. I actually am working on a collection of them. So I was so happy and excited to find these at Yoseka. And they always package everything so beautifully. And then just the ink boxes themselves. Oh, so pretty. Let's put those there few other things. I always love how they put things with their little stamp. And they always use such pretty washi tape. <laughs> That's right. I ordered a card with cheese all over it because I love cheese. So I'll have to decide who's going to get that one in the mail or if I save it and stick it on my cork board. I got a very pretty oops, roll of washi tape. It kind of looks like old antique wallpaper or Art Nouveau or turn of the century or something to me. I love it. It's beautiful. Morrison Co. I think it's actually, the pattern might have been taken from like a textile, like a turn of the century textile or wallpapering or something. I'm not sure. I'll have to, maybe I'll find that info. And, oh, that's right. I got some ink samples as well. Oh, I got diamine blue mold wine. I think this was this part of their ink vent or something, but some special ones. So, mold wine. I actually made mold wine this year, and it was really fun and very tasty. So then, seeing an ink, kind of the color of it, I thought that would be fun to try. And I love their little sample jars. Another linen toolbar cone eye. This was in the linen toolbar line where it's the shades of blues and indigos based off of the traditional textile dyeing. I forget what that is called, but this is an ink, a very pretty dark blue indigo ink of that line. Then, oh, here's another diamine blue edition, Solstice. I've been wanting to try this one for quite a while, so decided to get it in my order. 
The little jars are so cute. Oh my gosh. Two other things in here. Oh my goodness, they always send such a lovely note. Oh, and stickers. I love stickers. I mean, let's be honest, we, we order our things for the stickers, right? And, oh, Happy New Year and thank you for your order again. Yes, this is my second order with them. We hope you have some, we hope you, we hope you have been well and enjoying your Hobonichi planner so far. Yes, that's right, I ordered my Hobonichi planner. Oh my gosh, that's so personalized. They remembered or saw my orders. What? what? In the boys' um secret world. These inks and ink samples you chose are beautiful and will be, and will look as lovely on the pages as in your planner. Enjoy. Oh, that's so sweet. And bunnies, rabbits are just those are my favorite, and I love little foxies too. So that's so sweet. Oh my gosh. So like tape that into my Hobonichi that I got from them or something. So anyway, that is what I got from Yoseka. I absolutely love them. I will definitely be ordering from them again. They always get things shipped out in a super timely manner. Even if the mail takes a little while to get here, totally worth it. Um, they are just, they're a lovely shop to work with. So thank you so much for watching and I will swatch these things soon. Bye. So here is just a quick look at the ink I got from Yoseka. I did a little swatch in my Hobonichi that I got from them. I taped their note in there and put the sticker on the back. Use the washi. So the linen toolbar, the Sun Moon Lake Black Tea, the Winshan Pushong Tea, and the Mucha Iron Goddess. And they're just all very, very beautiful. The Kan Ai. And then the two diamine inks, Solstice and Mold Wine. Um, yeah, I really love them. I don't think I'll be getting full bottles of the samples anytime soon, just because I've got plenty of other similar colors I need to use up. But they are they are beautiful. And out of the three tea inks, I'm not sure which one would be my favorite. They're all so different. Um, the shading in both is really, really nice. And I did, I did all of the writing for these swatches with a dip pen. So it seemed to cap capture the, the shading pretty well. And I don't know which one I'll use first. It's, it's hard to say. Plus I would need to maybe clean some pins out <laughs> before I inked up another one. So thank you so much for watching. Bye.